Oh, I thought I'd just give you a, um, a bit of an update on what I'm up to at the moment. Uh, my main project is making that jet engine, which is a valve this pulse jet. Uh, but what I'm doing at the moment is the ignition system for it. And it's, it's turned out quite well. It's, it's, um, it's very successful, so I thought I'd make a um, bit of a video about that. Uh, I thought I'd make an electronic system. So I've got a, an ordinary car spark plug, an ordinary uh, car coil, ignition coil. And this is the circuit which I, I'd um, decided to use. Uh, it's on that little bit of Vera board. Uh, this ugly bit of aluminium is just a heatsink for the transistor. So you get a close on um, view of the circuit board. It's, but it's, um, it's not very well wired up at the moment. I'm only just trying it. Um, but this is the circuit diagram. Uh, it's a uh, 555 timer chip uh, uh, set up in its A stable mode, which means it gives repeating, repeating pulses out of the output, uh, which is pin 3. Uh, and the two resistors, R1 and R2, um, I've made 10k, and I found if I put a, a 1 microfarad capacitor in there, which is C1 on the circuit, it gives roughly 300 pulses a second out of the output um, which goes into the gates of a, a field effect transistor I've used a, an N channel 30 amp one so it's nice and, and low, a low on resistance uh, so the coil, the ignition coil primary is connected to the, to the positive rail um, and when it uh, comes uh, comes out of the other side of the primary into the drain of the field effect transistor, which gets switched onto the source, and the source is connected to high volt. Uh, and the and the secondary, obviously, the high voltage side is is connected to the spark plug. Uh, so that's the circuit. Um, well, what I did originally, and then, I know in years ago, I used to have a lot of trouble with back EMF with transistor circuits and, and uh, field effect transistor circuits so I used to put a, a diode diode in in there across the to load the short out of the back EMF but I found if I did that in this application it used to, it, it, to, um, it destroyed quite a lot of the, the voltage on the secondary so I took that off and it doesn't seem to affect the field effect transistor it doesn't blow up so I don't know whether they made um, transistors more back EMS proof, so I suppose I may have done, but you don't seem to have that trouble these days. Um, anyway, I'll, I'll give you a demonstration. Uh, I've got my bench power supply set at uh, 12.3 volts, which is roughly the voltage you get out of a car battery. Um, so if I turn the light off, um, coming close to the spark plug hopefully this will focus and I'll sort of switch the, the power on you can actually see that sparking which is it's a pretty pretty hefty spark which I'm quite pleased with so it should ignite, ignite the fuel in the jet engine so, so, it's, so it's, yes, it's going quite well I'll turn that off so hopefully I'll we'll, we'll have the jet engine running before too long and I'll make a, a video about that. So anyway, thanks for watching.